जगदीश प्रभु कम कम ऑन हियर जगदीश प्रभु कम ऑन हियर ओ महाराज यू शुड कम Namo 
Om Vishnu Parayan Krishna Priya Shumari Gaudavind Swami Shura Guru Dai Ki Jai I'm sort of unprepared to speak about my eternal spiritual master and uh, he left this world in 96 and uh, what can I say? I remember when I first saw my spiritual master, I walked into the room and um, he didn't seem like other people and I was surprised at why this sannyasi, he's not proud like all the others and not angry and I thought, there's something wrong with this sannyasi, he's not angry. <laughs> so then I, I, w I went to see this uh, sannyasi, he looked like someone from the Gaudiya Mutt, he, his cloth was a little bit different. and. Uh, I, I tried to ask him questions and he just said one thing to me with a, a very loud and uh, very authoritative voice. He said, surrender to a guru and, and you should give your life to him or take initiation from him. And uh, I'd never heard anyone stress the importance of taking initiation, surrendering to a guru. And I went away for days and, and I thought about it. That what does it mean, surrender your life to a guru? And he was so bold about saying it. And uh, then I went to Bhuvaneshwar and I stayed there for some days and I, I saw this sannyasi was very, very humble. And uh, everything we heard about Srila Prabhupada, who was, you know, who we grew up with in, in ISKCON, he was like that, very humble, very childlike. And he was devoid of pride. And he was very loving. And... Uh, I realized that he's a saint that has something very wonderful. He has love and affection. And uh, I became greedy to get the wealth within his heart, which was uh, love and affection. And uh, in this world, that's the only thing that's lacking is real lo love and affection. And I see in, in my Guru Dave, he was very sensitive to everyone. And uh, even before people spoke, he knew all about their innermost... Uh, things in their heart that even we didn't know about and uh, wherever we see that it's very attractive and I saw that in Sri Lanka so I'm also here to get that love and affection. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. Out of love we cannot speak so much. He was very brave. He never feared to anyone. And he used to tell sweet pastimes of Krishna, Mahaprabhu. He also was bosom friend to me. He collected my all books, all top to bottom. And whenever I used to print new books, oh, he used to know that oh, what book he is going to. And he at once used to take it. He was so brave and speak, speaking that all these corn leaders were second. Second means? Second. second. All were attracted to him. So they became jealous to him. All are going to him. And he was giving nectar like myself also. Same thing. He never feared from his own leader. But anyhow, he wanted to give up his cone, but he was bound because he gave his life for his cone and Srila Bhakti Vedanta Swami Maharaj. But he gave his life for him. But he never gave up his cone. But he told to his disciples at the time of departure, you should go to Narayan Maharaj. Asham Maharaj that time, what name I don't remember. And so many group, about 10 to 20, Narayana Bhatt and others, all went to Naudi and they wanted shelter to him. That our Guru Maharaj has told. Anyone cannot satisfy you, so you must go to him. He used to tell that only big, big, mota wala tilak will not do. 
and also this country, not huh? five kilo bit. Will not do. <laughs> Try to give up duplicity. Hmm? Duplicity. Be sincere. Duplicity, politics, if you are doing, all these are useless. Hmm? So, seeing his influence is going to bend on him not to come to Australia, not to go to Holland, not to go here and there. Bend down his speaking. But he was not a person uh, to be controlled. But myself, they wanted to control me. But like a lion, I jumped. <laughs> In some cases, he was bound controlled, but I never. They wanted to control. At once, I jumped so high that the trap cannot touch them. <laughs> okay. Now, we should begin our class. Agyanatimirandhasya Gyananjana Salakaya Chakshurunumiritam Jena Tasmai Sri Gurave Namo Bancha Kalpataru Vyasya Kripasindho Bhayevacha Patitanam Pavanibhyo Vaishnavibhyo Namo Namo Mahabhadanaya Krishna Prema Pradayate Krishna Ya Krishna Chaitanya Namne Gaurat Pije Gurave Gaura Chandraya Radhikaya Tadadaya Krishna Ya Krishna Bhaktaya Tadavakta Yanamo Bhaktya Vihina Yaparadhalakshaya Shiptascha kama di taranga madhu Kripa maitvam saranam prapanna Denumaste charanaravinu Tavai vasmi, tavai vasmi Najvam tvayavina iti vigyan radhe Tangnayama macharana In Chaitanya Chaitambu, Madhya 8, chapter, in the beginning is slow. Krishna Das Kaviraj Goswami has, been, has given gist and essence of the whole chapter in one slok. And that is Sancharya Rama Vida Bhakti Meghe So Bhakti Siddhanta Chayam Vratani Gaurabdhare Tai Amuna Bitirne Tat Graj Tat Jag Tat Arat Nala Tam Payaj He is praying that all kinds of Siddhanta Especially Krishna Tattva, Jiva Tattva, Maya Tattva, Radha Tattva, Rasa Tattva, Vilas Tattva, All Tattva. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is your ocean of all because he is Krishna himself. Krishna is the ocean of Amrita, Siddhan. But if he is combined with Radhika, taking the intrinsic mode of Radhika and beauty, both, and his mother Nakhabhav, you cannot imagine how he will be high. Now in this form of Sachinandan Gaurhari, 
he is o oh, endless ocean of all kinds of siddham Raramananda is bhakta. He is bhakta. Unknowingly, inwardly only, he inspired all this siddhant in Raramanand, like an ocean, gives water in clouds. But no one knows how we, by what process, ocean purified water, not salt, and it goes into milk. No one knows what process is there, and that beautiful milk, like Krishna color, every minute sky, and then. In Swati constellation, if that water comes down again on ocean, in ocean, what becomes? So many pearls, beautiful pearls. But only Swati Nakshatra. That is, only devotees like Ramananda, not others. He was really Vishakha Devi. Vishakha huh? Devi. So high class of. Say, Bhakta like him, he is like clouds made by ocean internally. And when in the time of constellation Swati, it comes down again as a shower. That showers in so many ships, ships, western sea. As big, some smaller, bigger, and so so kinds of very valuable hmm, pulse up there. And then the ocean is called Ratnakar. Ratnakar. Because pulse are Ratna. So these pearls are what? Shanta, Dasya, Satka, Varsalya. More than that, Madhur. In Madhur, Gopi moves. Chandravali mood. Shamla mood. Bhadra mood. All kinds of. Paksha, Vipaksha, Svapaksha, Shatastha, Suhrit, and so many things. Very, very valuable parts. So, from where it came? From ocean. And who, who is ocean? Radha Bhav Mirit, Gauchandra. And he unknown sent it to Raya Ramananda. And Bhavu, by Bhavu, mouth, by that cloud rain came, then Chaitanya Mahaprabhu became oh, Ratnakar. And by that reason, when he returned to Jagannath Puri, he told Ramananda, you should be with me. He gave up that post at once to king. King was very happy that now you will be with Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and his mercy through you are, I will receive. And good full salary to him, not cut out. Give him Raj Palace. Palace has buildings also and everything as he was governor general of that place. And now, with Raya Ramananda and Saurabh 
Now he used to take these pearls in his heart and realize. <coughs> Weeping bitterly sometimes. All the moods which are not disclosed in Srimad Bhagavatam even. In the Radhika mood, not written. Vyasde Sukhadev could not tell all these things because he could not utter Radhika name. Why? How he can do? So, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, Sachinandan Gauhari. This is all the symptoms which had never told for Radhika, but it was in Radhika. So, here is Raya Ramanami Sahaja. From beginning, we will try to explain all these things. No? Very beautiful. I don't believe that I have explained in such a way. When collected and given to me, I was thinking, who has written? <laughs> <laughs> then I saw, I prayed my Gurudev, that by the grace of Gurudev, also new, new thoughts had come. You know that Srila Srila Prabhupada has made Anubhasya. And Srila Bhaktivinoda Thakur has done Amrit Prabhu Bhashya. And also you know that this Bhaktivinoda has Thakur has a special mercy of Sarup Damodar. He inspired how to explain Bhagavati Sloks. And he told him to make a garland of these slokes. And he made very beautiful. Very soon it will come as Bhagavatarth Marichi Mala. How beautiful. I cannot explain. So, taking all these things from Sarup Damodar, well, Sarup Damodar, Raramananda, he has explained in his Amrit Pravah and Prabhupada in Anubhash. I have only collected from these things. And what I explanation I have heard from my Gurudev. I tried that I should give it to the world. The world should know what is Raya Ramananda Sambhav. So I want very qualified any person to translate all these things. Like Gita Govinda, Bhajan Rahasyam are going to be translated. But ordinary person cannot. They should have all the knowledge of all these things. They can do. <coughs> so, Here, in explanation, Swabhakti Siddhanta Chayam Mritani. Swabhakti Siddhanta Chayam Mritani. Swabhakti. What is Swabhakti? You should know. It had been told by Rupa Goswami, Swabhakti. What is Swabhakti? Anarpita Charim, Chirat Karunaya Avatir Nahakarau, Samarpa Yuttam Unna Tojjwal, Swabhakti. Swabhakti is there. Swabhakti means his own. Who is his own? Radhika. Radhika is his own. And he has a special mood. Snehman, Prane, Rag, Anurag, Bhav, Mahabhav, Adhirur, 
Mohan and then Madan. Up to that. Even Krishna has no Madan. Only up to Mahabhav. Even not Adhirud. Only in Lalita Sakhi. And he is Lalita Vishakha and all. But Chaitanya Mahaprabhu had combination of Radha and Krishna both. So, <coughs> Swa Bhakti, Radhika Bhakti to Krishna. Love of Radhika for Krishna. This. So, <coughs> what is that? I told something about that. <coughs> I told you, Kamatmi Kapakti, and again I told you, Lush, Mai Rati, that is Manjari Mohur. Here, Sadhyatam Vastu for Jeev, for Jeevas, they cannot have the mood of Radhika, never. If Lalita and Vishaka cannot, Krishna cannot, then how for it? So Jeev only he has qualification. Adhikar. Adhikar means? Yeah. Only in this. You can think that though all the audience who are hearing are of Manjari Bhav. But we should think those who are attracted to Mahaprabhu are very fortunate. Those who have come to Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, I think due to Rupa Goswami. And Rupa Goswami is entirely Rupa Manjari. How many you are? In this whole creation, like nothing, even not one drop. One drop has so many particles. I think that not even a particle. Particle has also some more particles. <laughs> so, nothing. So don't doubt. You are any, how very fortunate that you are attracted to this land. Otherwise, you can have gone to Ramanuj, Madhvachar, Vishnu, Swami, Jimbalat, here and there, there are so many things. In India, lakhs times of Sampradayas are, of Sampradayas are there. So here, who has Taken it to this world, only Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Before Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, no that kind of bhakti was there. No rasa bhakti. Only bhakti was there. Like Vaidhi bhakti. But no bhakti rasa. And especially he ordered Sarup Dhamma, the Raya Ramanan, to sprinkle their verses to Rupa Goswami, that he should be qualified to realize his mood and to establish in the world. So Rupa Goswami has done all these things. What is this Thai Bhav here? Not to Krishna. To whom? More inclination to Radhika, Radhika, Radhika Dasi Jadi Hoi Abhiman Shigramalaya Tare. So here, Rupa Goswami, always, if Radhika is unhappy, lamenting more, crying, she is also crying. Lalta Vishakha may console them to Radhika, but Rupmanjari, she cannot control. The same mood will come in Rukmanjari. So seeing her master, she will be like her master. So 
भाव श्रीकांत रूपमंजरी रति मंजरी लौंग मंजरी दे कैन नॉट वेरी हाई क्लास ऑफ देयर मूव्स तो हु ब्रॉड थ्रू दिस वर्ल्ड सुखदेव के स्वामी ब्रॉड निगम कल्पतरुगरितम फलम श्रीमद भागवतम एंड दिस मोर्स वनली चैतन्य महाराज बिकॉज इट हैज बीन रिटर्न इन फोर्थ चैप्टर आदि राग मार्ग लोके करते प्रचारण एंड वन लाइन प्रेम रश्मि जासी डी बट हिज ग्लोरिफिकेशन इज देर ही गेट द प्रोसेस एंड हाइएस्ट थिंग फॉर जीव दैट ही कैन अटेंड बट रेय How he did, Sanchar Jame Raman Bhakti Medhe. Oh, Chetan Mahaprinsh Pai first in the heart of Raya Ramanun, like a oh, unseen water goes in me, it becomes me, and then eat that make clouds. Touching any mountain, high, or jungles, so many trees, then it melts and comes one by one. What is here, like forest and mountain? Oh, see, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, even that thing. And then, Arara Mananda, cloud make was melting. And in the constellation, Bari Bunda, water showers. It came in the ocean. That is in the year of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. And now he was very much satisfied. And they, then what became? He saw Rasharaj Mahaprabhu. And he fainted. And so one kirtan, Krishna Das, Eta kirtan called. He has a kirtan here. Jodi Gaurangana Hita Again, come with me on the bank of Godavari, where Chaitanya and Mahaprabhu both are oh, telling Hari Katha to each other. <coughs> so, I was telling you that. In this mood, this mood is called not only Raganuga, Rupanuga. All Raganuga are not Rupanuga, but all Rupanuga are really Raganuga too. So, here, what that nectar? came from the cloud of Raya Ramanuja. What was that? Very sweet like nectar and it was Raganuga Siddhan, uh, Rupanuga. Especially the mood of Rup, Rati, Laung, Manjari. This was. You know that Bhakti is always very, very Anandas but <laughs> and very Ashwadaniya, trustful to extend these things. 
and now Mahaprabhu has become Ratnakar, knowing all these siddhans. What kind of ocean, not one endless, with big, big waves, but no kharatva, no saltness. Big, big waves of moors, sanchari, sattvic, babichari, and all others. But not waves in sea that, oh, they can drag you inside and you die. Not that kind of thing. Not roaring like ocean. Very sweet. Very sweet, like nectar. Ocean is not endless. Somewhere it ends, because in, it is in Prithvi, in Earth. If here, Gold Coast Ocean is here, and other side, any island or any continent must be there. But this Mahaprabhu Ocean, endless, no, eh? no bottom, no bottom, no end, this side, this side. No west, east, and north and south. Endless. What? In that ocean, in this ocean, so many crocodiles, so many sharks, whales, snakes, very poisonous. So many, we don't know. They can take Elephant also in their mouths. <laughs> they can turn over big, big ships. We know only up to whales. But I have heard more bigger than whales, Timingil. <laughs> they can swallow whales also. But no there in Mahaprabhu Ocean. What is there? Hmm? That is, there is no upasana of jnana. They are like Magar Bacha. They can solve all your bhakti, your, even your satta. Existence even. Maya Bhad. Nirvisha is Pramhabhad. It is like Magar Bacha. More than crocodiles. No? Jnana, karma, job, no upasana there. Only well, very sweet upasana of Radha and Krishna. Especially the upasana of Radhika. Hmm. There are so many rasabai chitri here. What? Oh, speciality of marrow. So many kinds of. Hmm. 63 kinds of mellows are there. Each Sakhi is each mood of marrow. So many. We cannot count. It is so endless that even Krishna Supreme Lord can and he will have no end of that ocean. Such. There are no Hriday Bidarak Uttal Taranga no big, big webs, hmm? high, high webs, and roaring like that. Hmm? Here, the pralambha and sambhog atmak, also rush by chitri is here. Understand? Sambhog atmak and the pralambha atma. Hmm? Very sweet. Sometimes this be pralambaras more sweet than Sanjogatmika. But by Tatastha, if you will think. Understand? What meaning? Oh, you? What meaning? 
of heaven. Hare Krishna. Srila Gurudev, he is saying that in this ocean, there are so many varieties of rasa, including the mellows of meeting, sambhogras, and mellows of separation, vipalamba rasa. Actually, if we examine from a neutral point of view, then we'll see that in the vipalambaras, in separation mood, there are many astonishing, wonderful varieties. It but dances on the sambhogras. Mm. It dances the on the head of the sambhogras. Mm. But if we'll examine from the point of view of one person in that leela, they will never admit the mm. fact that this uh, vipalamba rasa has so many wonderful things, they will think it is like a poison. Yes. Any Shakhi of Radhika, they don't want separation, though it is hard. What to Shakhis? We even don't want that. Radha should re repent, hmm? feel separation from Krishna. Hmm? This is that mood. So, it is so grave. It is so deep that Bhakta, Raramanand, and Bhagwan himself, Chaitanya, both can drown. Oh, this is so beautiful and very trustful nature. Now, A question may come. What question? If Chaitanya Mahaprabhu from before, he is the ocean of all kinds of Siddhanta, as he has been written, Bhakti Rasamrit Sindhu Krishna. Akhil Rasamrit Murti, Prashama Rucharuddha Tarka Apadi. If Krishna is like, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is like, and everything he knew, all these things, all Siddhan, then why it has been told that if Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is full of all kinds of Siddhan, Rash Siddhan, Vilastat, everything, then, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, if not knowing all these things, then how he can inspire in the Rai Ramanand heart? So he was. He knew all from before. What extraordinary or a special thing he had from Raya Ramananda, this is the question. Understand? Yes. Hmm. Oh. This is question. Now, Mahaprabhu knows all things. He is Sarbhagya. From before he knew all things. Now, Raramanand told something from his mouth. What Chaitanya Mahaprabhu inspired in his heart. And then he became Ratnaka. What is the meaning? What is my question? You clear it. As Srila Gurudev explained that Roy Ramananda is like the cloud, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is like the ocean. The water is coming into the cloud uh, from the ocean and Chaitanya Mahaprabhu then he receives the water from that cloud and then he uh, becomes knowledgeable of certain Siddhanta from uh, Ramananda Roy. 
So what kind of speciality, what kind of uh, understanding did Sri Ramananda Roy as the cloud distribute to Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu? And that now it is clear somehow? What a special thing Rai Ramananda gave. Huh. Oh, now you should hear. Hmm. What Chaitanya Mahaprabhu has knowledge? That was Gyan. Tattva Gyan. And when he heard from Rai Ramananda, then it became big gyan. There is much difference between gyan and big gyan. What is big gyan? Huh? Realized knowledge. And here, he has given example. Gyanam paramam guhyam yad vigyan samanvitam sarhasyam tadangascha grihan kaditam Krishna is telling that I have told you all who am I? I was from before after that I have told about bhakti, tattva and everything but you could not realize and he kept his hand and everything by mercy you should realize. And then when Brahma realized, then it became big gyan. You are hearing, not big gyan. When you will realize all these things, then it will be big gyan. So, Raramanan, hearing, inspired by Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, and he told all these things. What he told? What he told? Vishakha, always serving Radhika. No? So she knows the, all the modes of Radhika. All kinds of modes she knows. That Krishna never knows. He will hear from Lalita, Vishakha, all these things. And then he will realize all this. So this tattva, Raramanan, that is Vishakha Devi, knows all these things. Now he told all these things. Plus what Chaitanya Mahaprabhu inspired and realized by Raramanan. And then she told. And then Mahaprabhu came in Gambira and tested all these things. Otherwise, never. That is here. Without Siksha Guru, you cannot go an inch. Here Vishakha is Siksha Guru of Krishna. So by the help of Vishakha Devi, Krishna realized. How you can without any Siksha Guru realize all these things? Never. Sometimes I see there is something more importance of Siksha Guru. Guru Duk, they cannot Diksha Guru as a Marjada. He cannot open his heart, sometimes. But Siksha Guru, like friend, bosom friend, you can open your heart and he can open his heart. Diksha Guru may be like that, not may be like that. But Siksha Guru, always like that, bosom friend, like elder brother or Elder, not brother, bosom friend like this. He can open his heart to you. So he is like this. Siksha Guru. Here, 
ज्ञान मीन्स वाट कृष्ण तत्व ज्ञान विज्ञान राधा तत्व ज्ञान हियर वट इज रहस्य प्रेम तत्व इज रहस्य एंड तद अंग वट इज राधा कृष्ण विलास तत्व दैट हैज बीन टोल्ड बाई रामानंद टू श्री चैतन्य ऑल थिंग हैज बीन डिस्कस्ट Yes or no? Also here, Krishna is a bishop of bhakti. Sometimes rare, he became also ras, uh, ashe tattva, but very rare times. He is ashe of all kinds of rasa, bishop of all, even. हर्ष अद्भुत करुण रौद्र विभत्स व्यवहार विभत्स ऑल दीज थिंग्स एंड मुख्य रस शांत दस रात के बाद सही नौ साधक के हृदय पर भक्ति का क्या प्रभाव पड़ता है वट इन्फ्लुएंस On the heart of bhakta, sadhu, Krishna, that 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 not know. Mother Jasoda, so much affection for Krishna. When he takes Krishna in his lap, tears coming, heart melting. Krishna enjoys his milk, but what moods are coming in the heart of Ra um, Mother Jasoda? Can he know? If he cannot know the moods of his mother, how he can know the all the moods of Radhika? He cannot know. But what is bhakti? What is in Krishna heart is not bhakti. Prem. What love and affection is in the heart of Krishna? It is not bhakti. It must be in the heart of Ashray that is bhakti. And Simati Radhika is highest, highest kinds of Ashray. That has been called in the definition of Mahabhav, perhaps. Jawa Dasre Britti. And more? Sansam Britti. What is Sansam Britti? Radhika is topmost. Ashre. And when he does love to Krishna, herself can realize even in sometimes she forgets that who am i na so raman na so raman even forgets but only she knows krishna is sitting there he cannot realize but Here, there has come a chance for him by Vishakha. All the modes, because Vishakha is serving always, and he is his birth is same day as like Krishna, uh, as Radhika. His modes is like he, Lalita, uh, Guna Ramita, Vishakha. Everything. So now. Krishna has some occasion for opportunity to hear all these things. Hmm? Now, here, Radhaya, 
પણ એ મહિમા કીર્તિશ હોવા નહીં વા આ સાત તો જે અદભુત મધુરી માં કીર્તિશ હોવા ચૈતન્યુનાધાભાવિતમ weeping is service there yeah. <laughs> lamenting how when you will reach to this position you will realize Can I give my most to you now? <laughs> Quite absurd. 